sliced potatoes, which I have peeled and diced to about this size. I'm um, going to add some water now. So I've just covered the potatoes um, with water, not too much, just above the top of the potatoes, and I'm going to boil them for five minutes um, till they're just starting to soften, not fully soften. You don't need to use as many potatoes as I have. I have a big family, so um, you know you can use half, you know, five potatoes, a third, even three potatoes, and then adjust the other ingredients accordingly. So they've just been at full boil for about five minutes, I'm just a bit over. I'm going to turn the gas off and let it settle for about another so five minutes. sitting in the pot uh, after they've been boiled for about another five minutes and then we'll drain them off now. So, as you can see, they're not fully um, soft. There's still some shape in them. They're just slightly soft round. Okay. So I'm going to let them drain for another So while the potatoes are draining off, I'm going to mix um, my spices and uh, to mix with my potatoes before I start roasting them. So I, in here, I'm going to put four tablespoons of oil. Half a teaspoon of chili powder. And then tea, two teaspoons of salt. I'm going to add one large teaspoon of black seeds. And then I'm going to add mixed herbs. Um, which you can get from any supermarket. I'm going to add about two teaspoons of that. Mix the mixture. And once the potatoes are drained, I'm going to add it to that. I'm going to add the masala to potatoes. Now remember, <clears throat> if you've only done half of the potatoes, what I've done, so if you've done about five potatoes, use half of the masala ingredients, the spice ingredients, and the oil that I've, I've used. So I'm going to put it into that and give it a good mix. So I put them on my dish, nice and evenly. With my, my I've lined my dish, firstly with foil. And then with baking paper, it just take, makes it a lot easier to clean the dish and also for the potatoes to come off. I'm actually going to cover the potatoes because I want them to get cooked properly before they start browning off. So I'm going to cover it with foil and then I'm going to put them in the oven on about um, 200 degrees Celsius. And I'm going to put them on the bottom shelf for now. So I'm putting them on my bottom shelf of the oven for now, for the first 15 minutes or so. And then for the, um, another 15, 20 minutes, I'm going to put on the top shelf so they cook evenly. So I'm just going to take, I've taken it out of the bottom shelf. As you can see, they're cooking away nicely. So I'm just going to transfer it onto the top shelf of the oven. More even cooking. So I'm going to let them cook for another 10 15 minutes and then so I've taken my dish out now and I'm gonna let it sit for about um, five more minutes and then um, I'll serve. So there you have it nice brown golden spicy masala roast potatoes. So I'm serving them with some pita bread and um, you can serve them with naan, uh, parotta, chapati, rice, uh, roast chicken, tandoori chicken. Okay, bye.